Hello and welcome. My name is Chris Belt with Big Star Axe Source, located in Las Cruces, New Mexico. Alongside me is Roger Holt with Holt Consulting. We are here to unveil this new in shell pecan sorter. Roger is going to go ahead and give us the details along with the amazing new design of this sorter, followed by a demonstration. Hi, my name is Roger Holt with Holt Consulting. This uh, new pecan sorter is a result of 25 years of sorting design for tree nets. This sorter is designed with a very small footprint to make it easy to be installed in your plant. It is only 28 inches high and 38 inches long, but still does 15,000 pounds per hour. The sorter is designed where it can be configured to be operated from this left side, as it sees here, or it can be made to be operated from the other side depending on how your plant is set up. The user interface can be magnetically connected anywhere where it's easily accessible to your operator. It is designed in a gravity-fed waterfall configuration with no moving parts. This minimizes maintenance downtime and extends the useful life of your investment. Plant power into the sorter is fed to the electronics and the product flow system separately so that the product flow can be wired into a plant sequential start and stop system. Or the two wire interlock can be shorted and the vibrator toggle on and off switch can control the product flow. The primary components of the sorter that provides the effective removal of stick tights, sticks, and other unwanted debris are the LED light bars and the high pressure air valves. The system requires high intensity dual spectrum lighting to allow the camera and the computer to accurately identify which objects are good pecans and which need rejected. These LED light boards are built very high density, long lasting LEDs. If one LED burns out, there's enough LEDs packed closely together so that it won't affect the operation accuracy. And you can continue to operate the sorter. But a red LED on the ends of the light boards will light up to let the operator know that at some point it needs to be repaired. A technician can easily replace a single LED without having to replace the whole light board. But the light boards are easily pulled out for repair. There are 64 high pressure industrial air valves that provide the ejection of stick tights and unwanted debris away from good pecans. We have designed our sorter with a heavy duty industrial filter system so that no matter how dirty your plant compressed air is, the ejection valves will remain clean and reliable. Compressed air is the key to being able to accurately separate the bad product from the good flowing through. We have designed into this system a air pressure sensor and an alert siren so if anybody ever forgets to turn on the air compressor or is draining it filling up tractor tires this will alert the operator wherever he is in the plant that you've got an air problem and you're not sorting like you want to be it is a high-pitched loud enough signal that he can hear it above any of the other machines in the plant let me demonstrate This sorter is user friendly. The operator in the morning could just start it and walk away. The touch screen provides information to the operator. It shows statistics of what percentage that you're ejecting and accepting, what your pounds per hour process is going, how long you've been running this particular flow. You can hit reset to reset everything at the beginning. It gives you live pictures of what the cameras are seeing. But it can also display everything in Spanish or 
English. The ideal situation for stick tight removal and sticks is this test for stick tights and the test for shape. You can adjust as you're going to be more aggressive by just hitting eject more or eject less. And then if you're sorting some green Pawnee, uh, then you can add then this test, which is the green test, and can sort in that Another sense. Another thing that this sorter can do is if you have a lot of clean nuts that you want to extract some of the jumbos out of it or the small ones away from it, you can turn off these tests and turn on just to extract the small and run them through and it will eject everything that's small and you can just how small or you can eject the jumbo, the larger ones from it by just pushing the button and leaving it that way. The sorter always powers up in normal operation and operator mode. It has very minimal adjustments for the operator to just run every day for a clean sort. But there is then a supervisor mode that provides some more detail adjustments. For one thing, you can test all of your injectors by pressing this button and run four tests for each of the 64 injectors. You can also, um, whenever you get a new batch of nuts that are a little different than what you've been running, and you want to check to see if your adjustments and your settings are correct, you can run a training program and it will guide you through what to do to ensure that the hopper is clear and say continue. And then it says put 50 good nuts in the pan and run the good nut so it can learn what a good nut is. And, uh, and this automatically runs it through for you. We can also reverse the sort. If you have primarily bad stick tights or sticks or debris you don't want and a few good nuts uh, in the, the flow, then you can change this from eject to accept and it will do a reverse sort, bringing back then uh, the good nuts out of the bad. At the end of the day, all the operator has to do is just hit the shutdown button and walk away. You hit that. It asks you if you really wanted to shut down in case you accidentally did. And do you want to save the settings? If you've changed settings, then you would say you would. Uh, but then it just saves everything and shuts down. Thank you for watching this video. Please feel free to contact us with any more questions or information.